the demands for laser systems are ever increasing. And so are those for laser optics. Higher specifications can only be achieved if they can be measured. My name is Sina Malobavic and I'm Director of R&D at Laser Components. We are here in the laser laboratory next to our optics production facility. And as you can see here, we have a lot of measurement equipment for the characterization of our optics. I will now introduce our brand new measurement setup, which will allow us to produce a new product line soon and to guarantee high quality laser optics. What you can see here is a cavity ring down setup to measure the reflectivity of laser mirrors at 355, 532 and 1064 nanometers for angles of incidence of 0 or 45 degree. It is able to capture reflectivities up to 99.998%. The fundamental idea of the cavity ring down technique is the injection of pulse laser light in a passive optical cavity. With every round, the trapped light decreases due to the optical losses in the cavity. The decrease is described by a single exponential decay. The ring downtime increases with the decrease of the optical losses in the cavity and the increase of mirror reflectivity. This setup here has new special features compared to conventional cavity ring down measurements. First, we selected a laser source which delivers twice the pulse energy at the wavelength 532 nanometers and 1064 nanometers as previously installed laser sources. This enables a better measuring signal than before with reflectivities as high as 99.998%. Second, the laser source has been removed from the whole structure here. This prevents negative influences from the heating and cooling of the laser. And third, third compared to previously installed laser sources, the three wavelengths each have separate output. 355 here, 532 here, and 1064 nanometers. This reduces the conversion and adjustment efforts when changing wavelengths. And fourth, an avalanche photodiode from laser components with a significantly larger sensor surface is used as a detector. It is connected to an adjustment lens and housing via cage system. And last but not least, we improved control of the cavity adjustment after the mirror has been installed. This allows for more reproducible cavity settings for several uses and very little subsequent needs for optimization. So far, laser components was not able to offer highly reflective mirror coatings at reflectivities higher than 99.99% as commercial spectrometers reach the detection limit at this range. Therefore, we had no way to precisely confirm the reflection values predicted by the design software. Since we only offer goods whose specification can be verified, we now can expand our product range. This new setup opens new possibilities to enter further market segments of HR optics. So what are your future products? If you have any questions or want more details, please contact us. And thank you for watching.